guys welcome to the south of france vlog we are in nice just about to head out and explore the old town this place is so beautiful so this is actually day one so we arrived last night around 9 p.m so we didn't get to see much of it because it was quite dark so today is just going to be a day for us to chill explore nice and then the real adventure starts tomorrow we're heading to antibes and i'm gonna take you guys along with us so i'm gonna show you my outfit of the day real quick um but i'll do that downstairs because it's got a lot more lighting and i'll be able to show you let's go we have arrived <laughs> Ombre. Oh, I didn't realize. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. So we found a mango at the end of our street and we had to come here and try some of their pieces. Guys, they have a new collection drop. The pieces are insane. So I'm wearing one of their dresses in yellow. I have to turn you guys around so you can see the true detail because I'm so excited. So it's got this ombre detail going on with the yellow and then the orange. I am in love. Okay, so dress number two. Two is this gorgeous green number. I'm gonna turn you guys around because... Okay, so it's got this sort of like a crochet, very tight crochet look. And the fringe is where the party is at. Look at, look at the detail. So I'm definitely torn between the green and the yellow and orange look. I don't know. So we just found some straw bags for 20 euros. Loving it, loving it. Um, and we also found we also found these caramelized fruits that Shem has been looking for so we got a couple and we're gonna try them out they're gonna be absolutely fantastic so excited to try them hi guys so we just got back from a lovely chilled day of shopping we ended up doing a lot of shopping which was not planned but hey picked up this raffia bag um handmade with leather handles absolutely love we bumped into a mango and we picked up a couple of items i think i showed you guys trying on a couple of the dresses so i picked up the yellow one because it just made a lot of sense and shem loved that one the most so we stopped by a truffle shop the first thing that he made us try was this beautiful sauce noir a la truffle Mm, it's so good. Mm. What is the it? The best here. Mm, mm, mm. Yes. Wow. So the truffle is infused with squid ink, so that gives it the super black color. There's truffle oil, and you can use this to fry, to make salads, to do all that, all that good stuff. Last thing I picked up is ketchup. If you know me, you know that I am obsessed with ketchup. I think I went through a phase growing up when every single thing that I was eating had to have ketchup, including vegetables. That's so, me? yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, nostalgia, but grown up. It's given sophisticated. I mean, who has truffle infused ketchup? Yeah. yeah. So that's what we picked up from the shop. Let's get into this haul. So I picked up this beautiful sunset color dress. And this is part of the Simon Miller and Mango collab. Guys, can we get into the color? You start off with this gorgeous bright yellow and then it fades into this beautiful sunset burnt orange look. And on my skin, it really just does the thing. It really just makes everything pop. So I'm gonna wear this tonight for dinner. So next thing I picked up are these mini silver earrings. Yes, there we go. So I picked up these beautiful silver earrings to match this gorgeous statement choker slash long necklace. Wait, it's upside down. To match this beautiful 
silver necklace. The look is gonna come together tonight and I'm gonna show you. Good morning. So this is day two in Nice. Last night was amazing. We went to this beautiful restaurant called La Plange. The food was delicious. I had the sea bass. Shem had a beautiful risotto with some prawns and guys. That was some of the best seafood that I've tasted so far. Today we just got dressed. I'm wearing this beautiful knit top from Andrea Iyama and then I'm wearing the matching trousers that I got in Nigeria, Lagos. If you guys haven't watched the Lagos vlog, then you need to rewind and watch that vlog. And then I am carrying this beautiful raffia tote bag that we picked up from a store yesterday. We're heading out to Antibes later. But yeah, just gonna do a couple of runarounds first, take a couple of street pics because the backgrounds here are insane and then i will catch up with you guys later when we're having a beautiful beach day so see you later let's go So we made it to Antibes. This place is beautiful. I don't know if you can hear me, but I hope you can hear the sound of the waves because it's absolutely just tranquil, so peaceful. I'm gonna spin you guys around so I can show you what our view is because it's just something out of my Pinterest board for sure. So yeah, we're gonna have some lunch. We're gonna lounge around, just have a chill day. See ya. <laughs> This is our last stop in Antibes. We're here to catch the sunset and at the moment it's giving a little bit of a blue hue with a bit of purple. So we're here to watch the sun properly set and it's gonna be absolutely stunning. I can see a bunch of yachts there just ready for the sunset too. The food and the drinks are also good. So Baba is definitely one for your bucket list because yeah, it's got the vibes, it's got the views, yeah. So today is the next day. Yesterday we had such a beautiful chill day at, in Antibes. We took the train there. The train there was about four or five euros. 
and then return was five euros so all in total it was 10 euros to travel to Antibes and back the train line app works in Europe so I would advise to download it or have it downloaded already on your phone and then you can easily just book your tickets on the on your phone and have mobile barcodes on there and that really helps with the journey and trying to figure out how to use the ticket machines and stuff so today we have a chill day plan just about to head out check out some vintage stores in Nice let me show you guys my outfit of the day Get into the earrings first so these earrings we picked up in mango yesterday and I love them they are so vacation-esque like they just make a lot of sense so these little dangly earrings are from mango and then i'm wearing this old very old top from zara um, but yeah so this is today's look so we're gonna head out to the vintage shop first maybe stop and have a bit of brunch So it's the next day, I got this for 20 euros and there was a shop yesterday that we walked past in Old Town Nice that has a store full of bags that look like this and they have them in the mini sizes, medium, large for very good prices like 20, 40, 50 euros so yeah and it's also something to remember Nice by um, I tied this scarf that we picked up from Mango on the first day that we arrived and yeah this has been the look and i think it goes really well with every outfit actually because it's quite neutral so yeah let me know what you guys think but last night was an amazing night we went to this restaurant called nespo we found it very last minute the service was just superb everybody was so attentive we actually met one of the owners I had the risotto and Shem had the truffle pasta and it was so tasty taste the ambience the the type of people that were in the restaurant was just fabulous so yeah that is definitely one for you guys to put on your bucket list for nice but yeah so this is today's look of the day i'm wearing this beautiful jacquemus dress i'm gonna have to give you guys a full breakdown because i love the details on this dress it's got this metallic buckle and tie detail and then it's got you can't see it but let me try and put the camera down and then it's got this cut out with another tie detail i think it's just perfection so for fragrance of the day i'm gonna wear grand soir with soleil blanc and this combination is beautiful so we're currently headed to Cannes, and then after Cannes, we're gonna head over to monaco this weekend is the grand prix so it might be a little bit busier than usual so i'm sure it's gonna be so exciting um yeah, by the time this vlog goes out live, the Grand Prix would have finished, but I'm rooting for Lewis Hamilton, my guy, Lewis. So yeah, today's our last full day in Nice and the south of France. My heart is so full right now. I'm so, so grateful and so thankful to God for this experience. We've had such an amazing time. Yesterday, me and Sean were just sat at dinner and we were just, you know, just looking at the past couple of days just talking about how amazing it's been and how privileged we are to have had this opportunity and just you know been able to experience this together so yeah super grateful and very happy so getting ready to head out to Cannes we're gonna catch the train and um, the train is inexpensive other option is to get uber but the uber prices are like double 
what we'd be paying to get on the train and also the view on the train is very scenic so i don't mind that little experience as well to can in the morning and we had lunch at this place called la mandala it was very nice beachfront and um, the food was very good definitely recommend the octopus and the what do we have the burrata with the tomatoes that was so good we had a spontaneous trip to monaco just to close off the day it was very much a lot of the roads were closed simply because the formula one grand prix actually takes place on the roads of monaco so the roads that normal everyday people use that's where the Grand Prix takes place as well so it was very fun and a very unique experience as well so we ended up just walking around uh, stopped by for a couple of drinks and then we just headed back home but it was very very refreshing to be in that kind of environment with a lot of luxury cars a lot of celebrities it was very much electric the atmosphere was very much electric in essence we did three out of three and we're very happy this is our last day, we're just about to um, go downstairs, we've packed all our bags, we're about to check out, head over for a little bit of brunch and yeah, call it a day, we've loved it in Nice. Any last words? Um, Sweet. We're just grateful to God that we were able to do everything that we wanted to do. Yeah. Even the days that didn't go to plan ended up just being so much fun. Yeah. And yeah, it's definitely one to remember and we have to come back and do it again. That's right. So see you soon, Nice. Thank you so much, French Riviera. We have loved every single moment. Yes. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching until the end. Bye.